Hi everyone, my name is Shivarenja Simani. I am a fitness coach. I am also the owner of Rotator and Shiv Simani Fitness. I am a father, a dad, um, I am a dog dad, I am a husband, and basically an all-round fitness enthusiast. And I'm happy to be here. So I've always been into fitness, always been. I actually initially wanted to be a footballer growing up, but that dream did not come true just because of circumstances. Going through life, I was in football teams, I was in swim team, I was on the track team. So it's always been part of what I love to do. Going into uni, I wanted to do something relating to sports, which I also didn't get an opportunity to do because it wasn't offered here and we just couldn't afford to go outside. And then after uni, I went into the job market and I had a year of chaos where it was basically too much partying. <clears throat> basically my life was not going in the right way. I was in a number of drunk driving accidents. Being the one driving with you know my now wife and friends and no one got injured both times. And then I was in a street fight, almost lost a finger and an eye. So I think at the end of that year, I kind of didn't like how my life was going. And I'd also kind of stopped working out. I'd stopped playing football. For I quit alcohol basically. <laughs> yeah. It, yeah, it happened like that and you know, people started following my journey because we were just posting our journey at the time, uh, my first company. Uh, we were just posting our journey and people were following and now people wanted help with their journeys so that's kind of how it came up. I have been working out for about nine years. Hmm. Not many people know this but I am really good um, with dogs. Um, I understand dog psychology. Yes, I train my dog Mamba and I help close family and friends with their dogs too. I really don't know, it's not something I've thought about because I like what I do, I love what I do. I'd say maybe an athlete. It's still in the line. Yeah, maybe a sports scientist. Maybe. I, I, I love this, I enjoy this, so I, I don't want to change. Attractive and diner, yeah. Yeah. One year. Yes. 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 I leave it to the fullest still that year. It depends on like an intense season. So it's like I go through seasons. So some seasons are really intense. Maybe there's a competition coming up. Or maybe I just feel like I need to get back to better conditioning. I would train probably six days out of seven. Slow seasons like now, it being December and everything, I train three, maybe four times a week. Yeah. Uh, I love my body. Nah. But I don't like his body. <laughs> I don't like his body. Maybe in the mind of a tough one. I like the way Richard Branson's mind works. I like the Obama's mind works. Uh, yeah, I'm not that crazy about their bodies though. <laughs> I want to see the world from up top, so I want to skydive. For the, the northern lights, I want to experience that. Scuba diving, it's on the bucket list too. Yeah, wow. A perfect day would be waking up early, meditate, get ready, come to the gym, coach a few classes, work out, some breakfast, walk my dog, chill with my kids, have some lunch, take a nap, do some work, chill with my wife. In the evening, go for a walk again, maybe play some video games after that, and then just turn down for the evening. Yeah, I would say not following through, not showing, turning up to Classes, lack of consistency drives me nuts. When someone doesn't really introduce themselves, so I don't know if we met before or if I know you, because I don't like walk around expecting someone to know me. We're, we're a total stranger, but you know me from online and I don't know you, so it's like, at least introduce yourself and say, okay, I am so-and-so and I know you from here, you know. Then I'm like, okay, okay. Otherwise, I'm just like, um, then I have to ask, excuse me, sorry, sorry, who are you? And I'm just like, oh man, I don't see come off as rude, but I will ask, yeah, like, who are you, you know. A habit I'm proudest of breaking would be smoking. I used to smoke for like three years, cigarettes. And that was around the period when I stopped drinking. It was harder to quit, so I'm, I was very proud of that, yeah. I don't hang out much outside the house. <laughs> I like staying home. I mean, the places with good food, uh, like About Time has amazing food. If we're going out, there's, you know, I like open airy spaces. If a place has like one exit door, it's unsettling. <laughs> Yeah. Yes, I am. I'm big on self-improvement. I'm just learning myself, learning um, how to relate with other people, how to deal with different situations and um, events in my life. I'm still learning every day. Um, I would 
probably say I would like to maybe do something like maybe you know we're playing football or we're swimming or we're going hiking. Say maybe Lewis Hamilton. Yeah, at the beach, easy. Views or TV it depends. I like watching a few things, but I also like the views. I, I I'd say views. Yeah. Yes, I've had a serious injury, but not in the gym. I've had a serious injury uh, while playing football. Yeah, I've dislocated both shoulders around four times and around once. Yeah, um, but my shoulders are never going to be the same. I have to be careful every day with even how I sleep in certain positions. It can be tricky. I'd say weakness, I'm hard on myself. I tend to be quite hard on myself. Like if I set out to do something, I have to complete, I have to finish, and if I don't, it really bugs me. Asset is, I'd say, my discipline and control. Whether I'm motivated or not, I will show up. Worst date experience. I mean, I've been dating the same person for 12 years. Um, I, I can't say that on camera. It was a Valentine's Day. We ended up at a cop station. Nothing like serious, but yeah, that, that, that happened. It's a tough question. But I would say my biggest fear is, like, I don't know what my biggest fear is. Honestly, I, I really don't know. I'd say my dog. He was a big purchase, I'd say my dog. <laughs> uh, there's so many. Um, I mean, I love um, Joy Kennedy's work ethic, um, Crazy Kennedy's work ethic, um, Ivy's, just Ivy, um, my wife's. I mean, there's so many people putting, there's so many people putting in hard work, man. So much work. I mean, there's Joji, there's Eli, there's so many people putting in so much work online. I mean, say popular. Like I was a sanatorium captain, so in charge of like the sanatorium cleanliness and like making sure the schedule is followed. I was like in charge of cleanliness in our house, in the whole block. I was in Lenana. Changes. Yeah. I enjoy whiskey. You know, I like a whiskey once in a while. I don't have like a best, like I'm on a journey. I like smoky whiskeys and smoke. Yeah, that's one guilty pleasure, but yes, that's one we can discuss. You can expect a lot more fitness content, nutrition content. I'm building my brand Rotator. It's been a long time coming since I left my other company. A lot from Rotator. So Rotator, remember that name? That name is going to be plastered all over in this coming year.